The arcane infuser was developed by the court wizard of Zamak Castle. While it was one of the biggest breakthroughs in non-alchemical transmutation, according to the wizard's journal, it was originally meant to be a fancy bar trick to impress the local innkeeper's daughter. The outcome of the infusion depends on a few basic principles, which are all described in the Big Book of Magic. <sighs> but as to be expected, Peggy failed to read the chapter properly, and is about to make sure she'll never have the chance again. Why on earth did I think that would actually work? Okay, let's try something else. You're, you're kidding, right? If I infuse sword with a glowing mushroom, that means sword will emit a glow as well. Oh, oh, can't watch. Well, what do you know? It actually worked. Splendid. Now then, let's try something more radical. I'm sure the outcome will be golden. Oh, I'm so disappointed in myself right now. What have you done? You've killed our messiah. You've turned our holy goat into a lifeless chunk of metal. Seize her, seize the blasphemer. What the? Uh. Uh. Where am I? What happened? Looks like Peggy's adventure suddenly took a turn for the worst. How will she free herself? And what did the cultists do with Sword? Head over to the Questionable Quest subreddit and help Peggy escape from this goat-worshipping madness. <laughs>